Hey guys, happy Monday. Now, today you guys are gonna max out your snatch, okay? Um, obviously, we want this the full expression where you guys catch that in that nice overhead squat. Um, however, if we don't, we can't get there, that position's not available, we can always catch it in our power position where our hips are just above our knees, all right? So anywhere in between. Okay, so our power snatch, a couple of things we wanna kinda make sure we're on the same page about. Um, feet kinda, hip width apart to kind of get set up, barbell nice and close. You want your arms nice and wide, right? We want the arms nice and wide, we want the chest up, we want the butt down. I know that's a lot, but just kind of lock it in um, because how you start, a kind of predicate how you finish. So a strong start, a make for a strong finish, and a not so strong start, a make for a not so strong finish. So definitely we pay attention to that. So we want to utilize the hook grip too. So we want to go thumbs first, wrap the fingers over your thumbs. It might be uncomfortable for our newer athletes, um, but it's something that if you want to lift the most weight to your potential, it's something that you probably should get used to, all right? All of us have. So we get set up here, we establish our hood grip, knuckles face the ground. And you guys want to do that motion again, We'll have a recommended rep scheme and waterfall for you, but you have 15 minutes to figure out how heavy you can go. Hopefully it's the heaviest you've ever listed ever in life. And we want to celebrate you, have fun with this, go get it. Now we made it to our workout component of today. And we got an OD, CrossFit Games Workout in the Open 20.1. We want to go 10 rounds, right? We want to go 10 rounds. We want to go eight ground to overhead and 10 bar face and burpees. Now the ground overhead, you guys can do one of two ways, right? We just finished the snatch. So you guys can actually do the snatch. Take the barbell from ground to overhead with no interruption. In this variation, it'll be in your best interest to catch it with your hips high. So that one will look simply like this. Ground to overhead. The better practice variation is taking a stop at the shoulders. So the hands will be a little bit closer, just outside the legs, butt down, chest still up. Everything with the legs works just fine. We stop here, overhead there. So any variation that you're comfortable with, make sure you execute that based on your ability. Now our burpee, we always wanna be perpendicular to our bar or if you think of shapes like I do, you just wanna make the letter T every time. Chest and thighs hit the ground. Jump over, face your bar. Jump over. You guys got 10 of those. It'll be those two movements, eight reps plus 10 reps for 10 rounds. You guys are going against a 15 minute cap, so it's pretty aggressive. Have fun with this, go get it, let me know.